All right, people, what's going on? Um, another video about um, interracial relationships. Last time, you know, I had um, made a video about preference is not ignorance until you do ignorant shit and say ignorant shit, such as, oh, I can't stand my own race because this and this. Um, and people have been sending me a lot of videos about uh, or of some of these people on Instagram, TikTok. Um, most of the videos I've seen are people who are basically dissing the ones who um, will say some dumb shit, such as like, oh, like for example, like a black female saying, oh, I'm, I'm done with you black man, I got myself a white boy. Or a black dude saying, oh, I'm done with you black woman, I got myself a a, this, a white girl or whatever And um, They got y'all beat uh, Or some shit like that well, When Trick Daddy said that shit about um, Black women You better watch out Because these white women got y'all beat and shit like, like, You know what I mean It's just it's just stupid shit You know what I mean um, And That I agree with if, if, if you are Saying some stupid shit like that you better expect to get some backlash And you look like a self-hating ass person You do, you really do You look very dumb You know what I mean? And like I said, I've said it before Like all oh, Greek women, yo They all dumb, yo Like that's the reason why, You know what I mean? But it's not just because of that It's because of where I grew up You know, the whole saying of You're a product of your environment You know what I mean? And I know I'm repeating myself But you never know who might watch this video So, you know, coming from South Norwalk All I saw was Black women I mean black people in general But the only like Most of the time The women I saw were black You know a few Latina too And like a, a few white But like Like the, the Puerto Rican girls The white girls They they wanted black dudes So what the fuck was left for me You know what I mean So it, It's It's just a product of your environment You, you, you see the majority I, I, Y'all may not agree with it But the majority of people I'm seeing is black So that like really made my preference that And because that's all I've seen growing up And the, my best friends and people who I consider family are black My neighbors, most black So it's just like, that's what has always been my preference as, since, since a, a young age um, You know, women of all races are beautiful You know what I mean? But I do prefer black I, I would never say Oh man Y'all don't match up Y'all don't do this I'm just saying that, that that My preference is is black Cause it's Since a young age My first girl First everything Was a black girl Or a black woman You know what I mean So it's just like I I, I don't know what else to say about that Like Some people don't like that I guess You know you got these TikTok motherfuckers Like Talking about some dumb shit about you know, oh you stupid if you get into an interracial relationship. Like shut the fuck up, yo. Like everyone, I, I you know at the end of the day I can agree it's your page and you can say whatever the fuck you want on it, and especially if it's a public public page, just know people are gonna say shit on it. You know what I mean? Just like I'm, I have a public page, I know some people are gonna comment on this who probably don't agree. I might. Get some fucking troll with some some dumb motherfucker who's just gonna say this and that. All right. I have friends that are pro black, pro African, pro everything. Everything that they buy or own is black owned, or they they don't deal with nobody that's like not black owned. But they don't come on my page and be like, "Oh, you an interracial little oh, fuck you, Chris." Like you can't you can't do that. They don't say that shit to me. But they'll say it on their page like, yo, I, I, I'm I a black man and I'm going to stick with a black woman. Or I'm a black woman and I'm going to stick with a black man. And, and they're saying that because it's their page. But they're never coming to my page and saying that shit. Because it's it, it's a respect shit. You feel me? Most of y'all going on these pages, going on these interracial pages with people who never said anything bad about their own race. And y'all saying some stupid shit. You know what I mean? Like... There'll be an interracial couple And there's always somebody in the comments Like oh C-O-O-N 
Like, fuck you, you piece of shit. Like, you a real piece of shit. That's none of your fucking business. If you don't like it, why the fuck are you even entertaining it? Why are you even leaving a comment on that page, on, on, their, on their platform? Why? Just by you leaving a comment, you're boosting up the fucking um, the algorithm. Why are you even entertaining it if you don't support interracial relationships? So, like I said before, saying you hate your own race or dislike your own race, or I'm, I'm tired of these black women, black men, or whatever, why don't you say something positive? You found someone of a different race and you found happiness. Okay. You want to have your little private jokes? Fine, but social media ain't the place. You know what I mean? Because I can't control what you do, what you say privately. Uh, but you, f like I said, you found someone of a different race, and you found true love, and y'all fucking in love. Y'all, y'all agree. You may not agree upon. I don't think everybody's gonna agree on anything, everything. But um, you, you found someone that. You're just in love with And then Y'all do everything together And that person happens to be Of a different race Okay Say that You're happy Alright But don't fucking disrespect your own Alright And then You know some people send me The Godfrey situation About um Some people are like Oh he's saying some wild shit When you look at uh, The insurance thing And he said it was like Some insurance policy And it was of a white man And a black woman and that's mental That's like psychologically telling uh, People I guess weak minded people Because uh, anybody can be weak minded That oh wow yeah that's right Oh um I probably won't get a good insurance policy If I get a black man so let me get a white man That can be true in a way Alright And you gotta understand what he's going about You can't just be like oh You know what I mean Um and it's in the middle of Brooklyn in a black, predominantly black neighborhood that that, that thing is up. It, I, I can't say I, I, I don't know. It, 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 I can't say I disagree with him because when I was growing up, the only time I really saw anything that was interracial, it was like a white dude with a China, or, or, or Asian woman or um, a black man and a white woman. It was fucking rare to see a white man and a black woman. Now it's like fucking everywhere. I see it in mad commercials and shit like it's a white dude and a, and a black woman. Now it's rare to see a black man and a white woman. Or a Latina with a black man or or a, a white man with a Lat Latina or a Latino with black woman. It's, it's rare to see that. Um, Because when I was growing up, I was like, yo, what, what about me? I, I see that every time they say interracial, it's a black dude and a, and a white woman. But I'm like, what the fuck? What about me? I like black women. Why can't I see? And this is real legit, bro. I used to be like, yo, how come there's no movies or no shows or, or no commercials with a white dude and a black black woman? You know what I mean? Because I'm in that situation. I'm like, yo, every time it's interracial, it's always the, the, the black man and the white woman. Like, what about me? What about my preference? How many white... Uh, there's white dudes out here that date black women. What the fuck? You know what I mean? And I know I, I'm, I'm labeling myself white. And I know some people will come at me. Some, even some of my pro-black friends like, you Greek, motherfucker, you ain't white. <laughs> but, you know, I'm first-generation Greek-American, man. I don't know. Like, th there's some history to, to search when it comes down to that topic, too. Um, because I don't come from that generational wealth or that... the, uh, the sl <laughs> I'm not saying all white people, but especially in this country, they come from that slave master bloodline. Sorry, a lot of them. Uh, I don't. You know what I mean? Some of y'all may not believe it Because I've had some arguments When people try to tell me About what Greeks did I'm like first of all If you want to really talk about That whole uh, situation Greeks wasn't enslaving Fucking Africans When the Western Europeans Was doing it So yeah, Maybe you should fucking learn that um, But it, it, It's such a You know um, a Crazy thing Like We got people going back in time now see if somebody wanted me to speak about critical race theory um i try to do my research on it uh i don't know i really i really don't rock you know there's more black people that I've, been, I've been seeing that are against it there's so many black people that i know who are not republican who are not republic oh yeah 
Oh, let me just dive into that real quick. I know my ADHD. Oh my God. It's like when you when you don't agree with this democratic like ideology, these ideologies, you're a Republican or you're a Trump supporter. Let me tell y'all something, you stupid motherfuckers. Take that insult and shove it up your fucking ass. Shove it up your fucking ass. And go suck the fattest cock you can fucking find. And I hope you fucking choke until you vomit. And, tr and fucking end up in the fucking hospital. I don't wish death on you. I just think what will end up in the fucking hospital. Because that is so fucking ignorant. You want to talk about ignorance. People of all races, all genders, all political parties say ignorance shit. Let me just say that. That's the stupidest fucking thing you could say. Because I don't support that motherfucker. Like I've said, everything, every, every, all of these things that y'all look at as, oh, no, they're not, t they're, t no, it's the same shit. I don't trust none of these motherfuckers. All right? None of them. The media is doing a great job with dividing people. All right? And, and from, from what I'm seeing with this critical race theory and what I'm seeing with this new generation, they're doing something fucking wrong. Because now all of a sudden, I, I go, you go on TikTok and it's more division than there is fucking unity. And yes, I'm, I'm aware of white content creators stealing from black content creators and or other races stealing from... Them. Okay, how about there's an African dance crew somewhere that stole from a Jamaican dance crew pyrotex. They stole their whole routine and they're basically teaching it and making money off of that routine. Or choreography, I should say. So please, that, that shit could go all different fucking ways. All right? Yes. And we know about, oh, a lot of white people, they love the culture, but they don't love us. I know about that. Yes, I'm aware of that. But let's just be honest what we see on social media right now, the, the fucking, the divide that they're causing. All right? You got these young kids saying some wild shit. Bro, when I was growing up, I heard none of this. Oh, because you from the hood. No, no, no. I'm talking about, I heard none of this. None of this was being said when I was growing up. When I was in school, none of this shit was being said. It was rare for somebody to come up to me and say some dumb shit. And most likely, it was a motherfucker from the suburbs who thought it, that he was from the hood saying, oh, who are you? First of all, who was you? <laughs> you grew up in the nice part of Norwalk. I'm, I'm downtown every fucking day because that's where I'm at. You know what I mean? That's the only time. Other than that, this shit is going backwards, bro. Maybe I'm misinformed about this, this critical race theory. Because what, from what I'm being told by other black people who are real spiritual, even pro-African, pro-black, who don't support Trump, are telling me that they don't support uh, uh, this critical race theory shit. It... Uh, man, listen, it's some wild shit, man. I, I don't fuck with it. I'm telling you right now. You know what I mean? So, mixed relationships. Stop, stop disrespecting your own because you found you found happiness with with someone of a different race. Okay. And preference is not ignorance until you say and do ignorant shit. All right. And and I see. Somebody mentioned to me a, a post a while back. I got a minute left. Um, this white dude married a, a woman from some country in Africa. And he was wearing a dashiki with, with her and his two kids. Is that cultural appropriation? Let me ask you, how is that cultural appropriation? He's teaching his kids his mother's culture. Okay? He's teaching his kids his mother's fucking culture, bro. All right? Simple as that. That's not cultural appropriation. Cultural appropriation is I start doing some dance hall or African dances and saying, well, I learned it myself. Nobody taught me. And even worse, saying that I created the, 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 the dance. No. You know who inspired you? The motherfucker who created the dance and the, and the person that you watched on video. That's who inspired you. All right? I, I just... Whatever, man. Yo, I hope y'all have a blessed day, man. I just... Shit is going fucking backwards, man.